Spider-Man No Way Home is one of the MCU's biggest successes, both in terms of critical response and box office numbers. While the world is still reeling from the movie's shock cameos, there were plenty of monumental moments in the film that didn't include you-know-who. Of course, Aunt May's death is easily No Way Home's most devastating moment, but the ending wasn't an easy pill to swallow either. After Doctor Strange performs the spell that makes the world forget Peter Parker, MJ and Ned's memory memories are wiped, and Peter chooses not to tell them about their past together. At the end of the movie, fans are left wondering if MJ and Ned will ever remember who Peter really is. Of course, many people will be holding out hope that MJ and Ned are going to remember Peter as they once did, and if that's the case, it's bound to occur in a future Spider-Man movie. But how could it actually happen? Well, Sony producer Amy Pascal recently confirmed to Fandango that the studios are getting ready to make the next Spider-Man film. She also also noted that Sony and Marvel are looking at doing three more films, so Peter Parker will have plenty of time to revert MJ and Ned to their old selves. Obviously, any ideas about how this will go down are bound to be purely speculative in nature. Luckily, there are probably an infinite amount of ways in which MJ and Ned might remember Peter, especially now that the multiverse has been fully unleashed. The simplest way, however, would be to have Doctor Strange perform another spell. Naturally, Strange would need some convincing, since Steven also doesn't remember Peter, but you could argue that it wouldn't be too hard for Peter to convince him that they have a history if the youngster just explains some of the events that occurred on Titan during Avengers Infinity War. Only the heroes who were there on Titan could possibly know what happened, and Strange would quickly accept the possibility his memory has been tampered with. I'm Peter, by the way. Doctor Strange. Oh, you're using your made-up names. Um, I'm Spider-Man, then. After all, No Way Home makes clear that he has performed the spell before, so it's not like the mind-erasing trick would seem unusual to him. As simple as this idea is, that's the problem. It's a little too simple. If Ned and MJ's memories are to be restored, it'll likely be in a more dramatic fashion than simply asking Strange to make things right. With so many projects in the works in the MCU, and dozens of characters spread throughout them, it's not a far-fetched idea to think someone else outside of the Spider-Man films can help with Ned and MJ. MJ's amnesia. Wanda Maximoff is now more powerful than ever as the Scarlet Witch, and we know she's dabbled in mind control on occasion. Wanda is a trickier player than Strange, however, and you wouldn't want her putting illusions into Ned and MJ's heads. Still, maybe there's a more sensitive tweak to her powers via which she can undo Strange's spell. In this case, though, there would have to be some reason for Peter and Wanda to meet up. While Elizabeth Olsen is set to appear in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, it seems unlikely that Holly will make a cameo, and who knows what the MCU has in store for Wanda after that movie's released. One character who is rumored to show up in the second Doctor Strange flick is Charles Xavier. Professor X knows a thing or two about mind control, and if he effectively becomes canon in the MCU, he might be someone whose powers are available to Peter. With all the mind powers in his arsenal, it's almost a guarantee that Professor X could retrieve erased memories from a subject, especially when they live on in someone else. That of course, is assuming that Xavier even makes it out of Multiverse of Madness. There are plenty of other characters who could also help in the quest to revert the memories of Peter's friends, some of whom we haven't even met yet. Whoever it might be who lights the spark, here's hoping it happens soon. Because what is the MCU Spider-Man without his Ned and MJ? Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about your favorite movies are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.